What's up, Chosen Ones? It's G Wells with them, and them are you. Which are the Chosen Ones? And I'm Chosen to serve the Chosen Ones. <clears throat> hey, look, Chosen Ones. The season you just came out of is your Old Testament. It's, it's your Old Testament. To the power of God working in your life. It's your Old Testament. And in this Old Testament of your life, this is the, the, the part where God was showing you his power. Trying to show you how you need to move here on. Showing you what he requires from you in order to go to the next level. The things you need to conquer. The things you need to achieve. Showing you how you need to conduct yourself going forward. That's the Old Testament. That's the Old Testament of your life. That was your, your, the part of the story where you were getting instructions. You was going through a lot of stuff. You was going through a lot of things. You had to overcome a lot of situations and circumstances. And God had to give you some instructions. God had to give you instructions. And with these instructions, it helped you navigate through these problems, navigate through these circumstances and issues of life during this time period. This is your Old Testament. This is your Old Testament. God saved you from Egypt during this Old Testament period of your life. He tried to warn your enemies to let you go. Stop trying to block my chosen one's blessings. Stop trying to knock them off their path. Stop trying to intentionally do things to them to get them off their path and join the kingdom of darkness. This, was that, this is the part of your life. This is the time of your life right here. Where you was in the Old Testament. God was telling you, warning your enemies. Let my people go. Let my people go. They didn't want to let go. So what happened? He got the situation. The circumstance. With these people. You know what I'm saying? Well, whatever your situation is. These people on your job. Your love relationship. Your friends. Your family. He took you and you know these people to the climax, the climax of the whole situation where it's just like, it's, it's do or die now in this period. And God was giving you instructions, telling you how to move. And you was right there at the, the breaking point. That's the, the climax of it. That's like, they was at the Red Sea. You was at the Red Sea. God parted the Red Sea. And your enemy still on your trail. They still behind you. And you thought it, that was it. That was it. You thought that was it. But Big G flushed him out. Big G flushed them individuals, them, them, them people out of your life. He didn't flush them out. You made it to the other side. You made it to your promised land now. You made it to your promised land. You crossed the Red Sea. And just when you thought the enemy had you, God flushed him out your life. He flushed them out your life. They drowned. They couldn't swim. They couldn't swim in the water you swim in. That was your Old Testament. Now? Now. Yes, now. Really, right now, 
Like now, right now. Like this very second now, like right now. Right now. You in the New Testament. And in this period, in this stage of this New Testament, it's just God showing his love for you. It's just God raining down blessings on you. It's God showing you. It's God showing you his love. This New Testament season you coming in, it's going to be a New Testament to the faithfulness of God. It's going to be the testament of the truthfulness in God in your life. Your New Testament. You about to resurrect some of them issues, them, them circumstances. You about to resurrect your financial issues. You feel me? You about to resurrect your body. You about to go from like flaps to abs. You feel me? You about to resurrect your diet. You finna go from eating cup of noodles to eating steak and shrimp. With some lobster if you want it. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is the resurrection period. This is God showing his power and love for you through your life. This is this is the this is the era where you you performing miracles in your life. How she do that? How he do that? Boy, you're gonna be around here walking on water. And that's the and that's in a spiritual sense. You you gonna be walking on water, walking on spirit, man. You feel me? Like the stuff people you gonna be accomplishing and doing, people I'm like, what? You in your New Testament. This is the part where God is showing his love to you, how how much he loves you. For the sacrifice, for the different things she went through. You follow his guidance, his direction. Now it's your new testament season. And you gotta testify to the goodness of God. This your New Testament season. You've been through your Old Testament. Now this your New Testament. The resurrection of your life. How you bounce back in a new direction. You feel me? You're going to bounce back in a new direction. Things they thought you couldn't do. Things they thought you wasn't going to do. Watch you perform miracles. Yep. You about to perform miracles. God about to show you his love for you in this New Testament season. And this is G. Wells, and I'm out. Let's go.